Welcome everybody, I am Dan's Gaming, and Capcom has given me an early access version to the Resident Evil Village. We played a bit of the PS5 version, but aiming with that was like, Ugh. so they let me have a PC copy, so we can now aim and hit stuff in theory. So, yay. This is, like Playing with a controller for me is rough, when it's a first person shooter requires precise aiming on like zombies that move their heads and stuff. So we're gonna start again. But we're going to play with the PC version, and I will have a mouse, and I'll actually be able to hit stuff in theory. So we're going to go ahead and jump in, and I'm going to wipe my memory. And I've forgotten the entire game, and we're going to play it from the beginning again. All right. Here we go. Village of Shadows. What? There's something above Hardcore? Oh, my God. How rough is hardcore, though? Yeah, there's Village of Shadow difficulty, which is like, what? Let's see. I am curious. <laughs> it's a uh, auto lock with pre-purchase. Okay, I'm gonna do standard on my first playthrough, and then a second playthrough will do a hard playthrough. Because I wanna do it for, I just wanna get through the story and stuff. So I'm gonna do standard. Standard seemed pretty good balance of, you know, difficulty without dying like every two seconds and reloading. Um, so we'll try that later. And we're gonna try standard. And then when we play this again, we'll do the hard mode. I think it's a more entertaining playthrough when it's, it's still plenty hard, don't worry. All right, so we're going to go ahead and try standard difficulty. Here we go. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Fins don't have Continuing nutrition, on, though. She soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Are you trying to give this kid nightmares? What is wrong with you? There. 
She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. The woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> A local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. She's got a bit of an attitude in I'll this I'll finish game. dinner. Oh my god. What have you been feeding this baby? It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember him. I can't blame her. Did you say something? Nothing. Nothing. I'll put her down. I didn't say anything. Mom got you another new book? Well, she's uh, pregnant. Or this is after the pregnancy and she just didn't oh, care yeah. anymore. We've what all been there. All at the beach. Three lovely. years ago. I couldn't even imagine something like this would happen. Once you're a big girl, we'll have a drink together, all right? What kind of an alcoholic says that to a baby? <sighs> Our taste in music's definitely improved over the years. You mean mine has. No, I like good music. I like the Delray person or you other hungry? people. No? Is that a Maybe singer I sung with a Del Rey? I don't know modern singers. Don't get too close to me when I'm cooking, babe. Lana Del Rey. Yeah, see? I, there, I, that's a person, right? That... Hey, what are you doing, mister? Nothing. Just carrying our baby around. Mm, don't give her any sugar or honey and no mushrooms. Looks like this baby's getting lots of sugar and honey. Juice? Why is the juice in the cabinet, not in the fridge? Holy damn, the size of those baby food Ian bottles. makes everything by hand, so this stuff keeps piling up. Why is that bottle so big? Baby food bottles must be like this little size. That thing is massive. It's like a family-sized bottle of spaghetti sauce. Just for a baby. Took forever to pick these wipes. Why are children's shows? You ever watch a kid's show on TV? Some of them are so creepy. Just bizarre and creepy. Baby monitor, it's turned off. up the camera just a little bit um, movement with mouse aiming with mouse we'll try that see if that works yep. that's the good thing and bad thing about uh, a mouse is I can move it real fast now but it also makes it for you, go, ah, my head. <laughs> Probably just a, a notch down ought to do it. Probably that ought to be good. She's going to grow up beautiful. Well, she's not starting great. Let's hope she turns beautiful at some point. There, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Mm -hmm. I had baby recently. Baby back ribs. And barbecue sauce. Mia's medication. Mm 
Your mama and I love this song so much. Why is that so... That is a massive music box. Huge. Let's put the baby away. Almost there, honey. And then we'll look at the other things real fast. There you go, sweetheart. <laughs> Let's put it away. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. <laughs> Beautiful. Aw, cute. Uh, me and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago, and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our new life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly. But I still feel a part of me is trapped in the hell hole back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't get like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend that it didn't happen? Should we face what happened there, uh, there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging over our heads? We owe her that much, at least. Excuse me, I'm streaming here, sir. Hold on. <laughs> Freaking lawn people outside making lots of noise. <laughs> we are that much. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have exploited that at the hospital. She didn't care. <laughs> Aww. Pictures. Isn't that pretty? Baby pictures. I don't know whose writing that is, but they must be a doctor. I can't read that. I wish it could stay like this forever. Oh, look! The baby's already doing hot tub streams. Getting ready early. Oh, hello. Rose's favorite toys. <laughs> hello there. Nothing in there? All right, look around. <laughs> yeah, I got a little detail in the house, all the lore bits and stuff that you can completely ignore if you want. Why do I even keep this around? I should get rid of it someday. Little bobblehead. Weren't those in the seventh <coughs> game? Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Uh, curtain closes on Dolby gas incident. The committee completed their investigation the 18th into Dolby toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. Clue the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that built up in the mud rock around the area. Jack Baker and his family, uh, who were exposed to the gas, perished. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to have been nearby, but the current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed off by officials who believe it was at least 10 years before the area is ha ha no, habitable everyone's again. Everyone's forgotten about this already. Start looking at architecture of Eastern European castles by George Trevor. All right, well, let's go have some dinner with our wifey. Definitely some shadow flicker happening on the rugs. I don't know why. Honey, is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Mm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de la gum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine, too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. <sighs> you really have to stop worrying. It's just I know. finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here. Military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's, everything's gonna, gonna be seriously fine. Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? Everything's gonna be it fine. It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so... <laughs> Mia, get down! <laughs> Mia! Mia, 
Oh, God. Chris? What, what the, the hell? hell, Chris? Sorry. No! What? Why? You piece of shit. I didn't even have dinner yet. Go move! All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. I'm not a dog, don't tell me. <laughs> Ow, that hurt, you bitch! Who's... Me in the face with a freaking rifle. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about the next Thursday, four o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the Doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. I, I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just. Mia, what are you, what are you talking, talking about? about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. I couldn't possibly put him on hold and talk to you. I have to take this right now. I couldn't possibly finish our conversation to further our relationship, but no, I gotta put work first. It's funny, this game has, the PC version has longer load times than the PS5 version. The PS5 was instant with the, their SSD technology. Jesus. Like, this is on PC on an SSD drive, but whatever the PS5 in it has in it, it is blazing fast. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose. Who is it? This is a secure channel. You are not authorized to You're not authorized to punch me in the face and take my daughter. What the hell happened to you? Yeah, the PS5 has like cutting edge technology on their SSD. Eliminate target, recover body, secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Move the two winters winter to site C for the investigation. These two transfer officers accompany them. Why the hell would Chris like just murder the hell out of Mia? Granted she was probably still kinda like infected with that stuff, but Very dark and out here. Uh oh. I know, like, wh why, like, shoot and blow her the hell up? That just doesn't make any sense. Like, can't you just. You could just, like, come in and take her. You don't have to do that. I don't know what they're. why they're doing this. Yeah, she probably can't be killed. She'll probably just get back up. It just takes her a long time to regenerate. Just... Rose? 
You hungry, baby girl? Feed me, daddy. Having a light snack? Crows hanging up? What the? Oh. Ethan and Mia are the main characters of Resident Evil 7. I saw something run by. I think it was just a deer. Very large, growly deer. Um, anything in here? Guessing a rope in here, maybe? Freaking psychic. Uh, yeah, we're playing the PC version now. We were playing the PS4 ver 5 version earlier. But now I have a mouse, and I'll actually be able to aim and hit stuff in theory. trails going down here why is he aiming the flash at the ground and not forward I don't understand that nasty shriveled fruit they have garlic everywhere in this place looks like mosquito Jesus what the hell is that Jesus. There's like the symbol of a fetus in a circle. It's like a cult symbol. Freaking rat. Oh, okay. It was just a rat. We're fine. So much blood everywhere. What did all this? Was that door there before? Kind of seems like a rush carpentry job. W to climb over. At least we can see now. Where Whoa. the hell am I? That's gorgeous. Windmill. Factory. That is so cool looking. It's like a vampire castle. Oh my 
God, they're not horsing around in this town. Hello? Maybe, in? maybe they're out. Easy to pick lock. Soup, it just looks abandoned. Blood everywhere. Mosquito Jesus again. Plowed through here and destroyed everything. I need some sort of wrench or something for that to open that. Like there's a golden bird cage up there. House is locked. Yeah, PS5 loading is faster, but it's only like half a second of loading on PC. So it's not like it's that bad. It's just a bit faster. Let's uh, look around a bit more. What happened? Goat heads. This place is so eerie looking. Locked due to missing homeowner. Some force could break. Like a knife. First aid kit. Cattle inventory. Hello. Did they just run out of the house? That soup looks super abandoned, like it was fresh. Hello there. Friendly, friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? How do you Nobody. miss with a shotgun, there by the way? There was an accident down on the road and... What's going on? Oh no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Did I have one? Take it! Take it! Help me. Hey, are you listening? Hey! You okay? Shit! Dead body? 
Wait, there's more. You would think after the events of Resident Evil 7, he'd be desensitized at seeing dead bodies. It only happened a bunch of times. Jesus Christ. They're just piled up in here? What the hell is wrong with this place? <laughs> what is that moving right in front of us? Oh, oh. Oh. Hey. Those were my fingers. I like those. What the fuck was that? What the No. I enjoyed those. You piece of shit! Much better, much better aiming. Hit him way more times in the head than randomly other places, but. That's fine, I have tons of bull. Oh, I thought I had 60. Oh shit. Not six. Chem fluid. Herbs. I thought I had 60, not six. <laughs> it's six zero. I'm like, oh, six zero, it's 60. I don't want to waste so many on him. Did he even drop anything for me? No. Oh, that's a waste. So I tested both difficulties, the hard, uh, hardcore and uh, standard. And they take the same amount of bullets to kill. They just dodge a little less, and then they also, um... They kill you in three hits instead of two. So that's the difference. And you get the same amount of loot on both difficulties, so... They don't skimp you on bullets or anything. Um, on any- on the two difficulties. Bolt cutters. Now there was the same number of enemies too, with the same amount of bullets. Just a little more durable. Alright. Uh, you can tell they're this game is paying big homage to 4, with a lot of the mechanics in it. menu 
can make an extra one of these first aid kits. Go near the fields next episode.